well hello dolls and welcome to my channel if you are new here welcome 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 and if you are not new you've been here for a while then welcome back happy 2021 you guys we made it to 2021 like wow this is an amazing accomplishment if you got through 2020 you should be very proud i'm so happy to be here sitting in front of you right now um i am getting ready to talk to you guys about my favorite things from 2020 beauty hair skin that's it i do have a bit of lifestyle things in here but these are going to be some of my favorite things that got me through 2020 it's not much because i mean what did we do in 2020 we didn't do much um, but i do want to share some of my things that uh, make me feel special made me feel pampered and hopefully you guys enjoy it if you like videos like this don't forget to give me a like and if you are not subscribed please subscribe to my channel i have plenty more content to come let's get into it so the first thing i'll talk about is hair products so my favorite deep conditioner from this year was the camille rose deep conditioner and it is the coco deep conditioner it smells so good I hope it's still on the website. I'm not quite sure if it is, but I got this 2019 from her little gift sets that she had with the body oil. That's amazing too. But I love this Coco Deep Conditioner. It makes my hair so soft and so manageable. My hair loves this stuff so much. My next hair care fave is the Curl Days Glossy Shine with Kakui Oil Glossy Gel love this so much oh and it smells so good it leaves my hair super shiny it doesn't flake up or leave any residue which i really enjoy um and it gives a medium to high hold which is my favorite thing because once i do a wash and go i don't want to do my hair for another seven days sometimes i'll do a co-wash in between but if i can get away with having a longer wash day then I'm obsessed so this has definitely done it for me and it is designed for wash and goes rod sets edges twist outs and braid outs so I highly recommend you pick this up this will definitely be a read up this year I will definitely get a whole stash of this love this and if you didn't know this brand is from curl days um, she is a natural hair youtuber and Instagrammer she's amazing so beautiful and I'm so happy to have this product the next product that I'm going to mention is the Main Choice Tropical Moringa Pearly Braid Out Glaze. Bomb, y'all. I promise you, this is so bomb. As you can see, I have demolished this. This is my first jar. I started using this this year, um, maybe around summertime when they had a sale. But y'all, I am so obsessed with this. I even love using this on my son's hair. Um, he has 4C texture hair and this works amazing. It defines his curls and it's great with the flats or braids that I put in his hair. So, all right, so that is it for hair care. I zoomed through that. Let's talk about makeup. So the first makeup product that I'm gonna mention is the Juvia's Place the Saharan Blush Volume 1 palette. I've had this for some time now like since it came out which was quite a few years ago but I have demolished this palette this year you guys. This has been my favorite. Um, anytime I do like a soft glam look or something where I need to just you know define my cheeks really well because I'm not doing too much on the eyes I go for this palette and that's quite often because that's usually my go-to look. I love this color right here, Neo, and I love the co color Abbey. This is a great contour color for someone my shade and a little darker. Amazing. I even have a palette like this in my kit for when I do makeup on my clients because I love it so much. If you are my color or a little bit darker, I highly recommend that you get this palette. It's probably only like $10 which is amazing because the pigmentation is a one. Next two makeup things I'm gonna talk about are translucent powders. I am obsessed with translucent powders. I feel like they give an amazing finish to the skin. And the favorites that I'm gonna talk about are from Laura Mercier. So you guys know that she had the translucent medium deep. That's always been a thing. Um, but I recently saw that she came out with Translucent Honey, which is a soft yellow powder, kind of like banana powder. 
And y'all, this is amazing for underneath the eyes, even chiseling out the jawline. It's so smooth, so microfine, like it's perfect. I love this especially for my brides or anybody for that matter, but more so my brides because it gives that very soft veil-like finish. It looks like um, just like a veil over the skin. It's amazing. Um, I love this medium deep. I used to use it on my skin when I was out getting sun, but it's a little too dark for me right now. But I do use it like in the contour areas um, and this I use as like my highlight i also use it all over my face because it doesn't give off too much yellow but just a hint so it brings a little bit more gold into the skin love this so much i will definitely repurchase these and i do have some in my kit separately that i like to use for my clients love them will definitely highly 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 recommend my last makeup bit would be the prep and prime fix plus I rave about this all the time. Um, I, I feel like I can never not have this. Um, since I started doing my makeup, I've always used this. And this is my favorite. My favorite scent is the coconut. When they came out with the scents the first time, Yuzu was my favorite. But they haven't come back out with that. And I'm really disappointed because I love that scent so much. Um, but I do love the Prep and Prime Fix Plus. It makes my makeup look less powdery. Um, it gives it more of a natural flawless finish which is my favorite thing you guys know if I use it on myself I'm gonna use it on my clients especially if they have similar skin type as me so love this it's in my kit it's on my vanity it's everywhere obsessed okay so moving on to skincare my favorite part because you guys know I am a licensed full specialist I do all things under the beauty umbrella except for hair okay so I'm gonna just keep going with the makeup slash skincare products this is the Laneige um, lip sleeping mask and this is the berry flavor mm, that smells so good but I also really 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 love the sweet candy flavor that one smells amazing as well I have it on my lips right now. That's all I have on my lips is, oh, actually, no, lies. I do have some of the Laneige Gummy Bear Lip Glowy Balm, which is another fave. I'm just a fan of the Laneige um, lip products. They're just bomb, like super bomb. They make your lips so soft and supple, and they don't feel sticky on the lips, like that tacky feeling that you get when you put lip gloss on, but they have such an amazing shine like a gloss. I do use this when I do my skincare in the morning and at night, and then I use this throughout the day when I'm at work or when I'm just on the go running errands. Love this, and I do love the gummy bear flavor. I think I like it more in the lip glowy balm. Um, I did smell it in the lip mask, and I wasn't that big of a fan. Um, some might say it doesn't smell different, but to me it smells a little different, but I do prefer it in the um, balm. Okay, so moving right along, let's talk about my makeup removal. So this has been my go-to makeup removal this year, and this is from Pharmacy. It's the Green Clean Makeup Melt Away Cleansing Balm bomb y'all it's amazing i've used all of this um a little goes a long way so you don't need much um and i like this because once you put it in your hands it just literally melts everything away you don't have to tug on your skin you don't have to pull on your skin even mascara it makes it come off so quick waterproof so quick it is a bit pricey though so if you don't want to spend that much money then try something else they do have it in a smaller jar too i think for like 20 dollars. i think this one is 34 on sephora but um i would purchase this over and over and over and over and over again because it's, it's just that good next on the list for skincare has been all things urban skin rx all things my favorite face wash from them is the cleansing bar um the what is it the clear skin cleansing bar you talk about pimples you talk about acne gone it's that 
good. I have breakouts right now and I realize I have breakouts because I am not cleansing my skin with my Urban Skin RX. I ran out, went to Target, they didn't have it, so I have to make a purchase online. That's something that I just I just cannot live without. Love that one. I also love the even tone one. That does a great job for getting rid of discoloration. But anything Urban Skin RX, you have to try it. I also been loving the Urban Skin RX Pumpkin Pore Detox Mask and Scrub. This is amazing for if you want that exfoliation, a light exfoliation, but you want to leave it on as a mask. It smells just like pumpkins it smells like fall it smells like all things yummy and i love it because it warms up on the skin so you feel it activate give it a try another fave from urban skin rx has been this complexion protection moisturizer and i like this because it does not leave that white cast that a lot of um sunscreens leave and it's super um absorbent like it goes straight into the skin it doesn't leave a sticky residue i love it so much and you see the little glow that it leaves on the skin it's just perfect it's perfect for us melanated sisters who need the sun protection you need spf don't let anybody tell you you don't need it you need it even though we have darker skin we still need protection okay so i definitely recommend you pick this up this is spf 30 so high grade SPF and it doesn't smell funny it doesn't like I said leave that purpley tint on the skin and it's only about maybe what $20 so pick it up I think you can get it from Ulta Target online um, I'm sure there's other suppliers but try it for one of my favorite skincare devices this year has been this facial massager i've used it so much and it's from my girl jennifer she owns a shop shop my evolution what you do is you put a battery in this bottom part close it up and then you turn it on and it just gently massages your face if you hold a lot of tension in your cheeks and in your jaw um, even in the forehead area this is amazing because it has a light vibration can you hear my nail clicking on it all you do is just gently lift up I recommend you use an oil or something that'll give you some lubrication I know we faced a lot of stress this year um, a lot of challenges so get you something that's gonna make you feel good you can use it while sitting on the couch you can use it while you are um, brushing your teeth <laughs> however you do that <laughs> but you can use it while doing so many things um so yeah definitely recommend it and check her out because that's my girl it's black owned sister owned y'all support her she is amazing doing amazing things and i love this product last but not least i cannot end this year without mentioning my favorite brand um my favorite black owned brand that i have collaborated with this year and that is Cool Coffee Click. I'm so excited. Um, I am a brand ambassador for Cool Coffee Click. And as you can see, the mug is popping, y'all. It is so cute. Um, I do enjoy just sipping out of this mug. I, I usually just save this for like my special coffees, um, my Cool Coffee Click coffee, and just special drinks that I want to indulge in. But I love this. The coffee alone is so good. It's so good. It's strong, y'all. It's strong and smooth and just everything that you want. It's an experience. It smells amazing. So when you brew it, it just radiates throughout the house. Obsessed. It's amazing and it's so pretty like the box is just so stinking cute the cup is so stinking cute and hopefully you guys get your hands on this coffee it is live on the website www.coolcoffeeclick.com they have so many different things they have hot chocolate they have different cups t-shirts mugs um travel mugs everything that you can think of all right dolls that is it for my 2021 faves hopefully you enjoyed it if you did don't forget to leave me a thumbs up and don't forget to subscribe if you are not i would really appreciate it and i want to see you guys 
come back for more. There's so much in store for us for 2021. God has been so good. He has been so faithful. And I am so blessed. And I thank you guys again for watching. And until next time, I see you gorgeous. Bye.